Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another UFC reaction. We are checking out the main event of UFC 305. It's just about to start. Um, yes, yeah, so we got Adesanya versus Strictus Duplessis. Very excited for this one. Been a long time since Adesanya's fought, obviously, and then DDP and him have kind of had a rivalry going back like a year or two with uh, some of the stuff they said to each other. So yeah, it should, should be cool. Um, I did read that DDP actually is having Sia Khaleesi and Eden Etzbeth uh, walk walk him out to the ring, which is pretty sick. Uh, a couple Springbok legends, if any of you guys aren't uh, familiar with rugby at all, uh, like I was uh, six months ago or so. Um, uh, so yeah, if any of you guys you're watching it uh, that are from my rugby reactions, yeah, you'll get to see them, I guess. It'll be pretty pretty cool to see them. Um, yeah, I don't really know who I'm rooting for. Um, I, I was a big Izzy fan, but I've kind of soured him soured on him a bit um he's gotten yeah he's got a bit more like <laughs> you guys know he's got a bit a bit more cringe as he's uh i mean he's always been kind of cringe but i've kind of just not enjoyed his his antics as much as lately but i'm, I'm also not, not a big ddp fan so yeah i probably i probably would be rooting for adesanya i guess because he's just like you can't really deny that he's an all-time great it, it sucked to see him just like fall into mediocrity as his career uh winds down so uh, yeah i guess i'd say i hope he i hope he can win it but yeah yeah i guess yeah we'll just hop into it in a second here uh make sure to drop a sub drop a like comment your thoughts on the fight whatever happens um i usually um if, if, if this is your first time watching your reaction to mine i usually will have like the whole fight not the whole fight but i'll anytime something happens in the fight i'll put it in and i'll i have to edit it edit it a bunch though so i'm not like showing the full footage but I'll, any, anytime i like react or anytime like a big punch is landed or something i usually include it so yeah that's how that's how i kind of do them uh, it seemed to work pretty well, but yeah. Anyways, long talk. Let's uh, let's just get into it. All right, here's the walkouts. He's coming out first. This is out of Sanya, right? The challenge usually comes out first, I think. You curious to see the reception for Izzy? I feel like didn't he get booed one time in New Zealand or Australia when he came out? I, for, I forget. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys think about him. Izzy from Australia. All right, let's see. Let's see Khaleesi and Nedsmith. That's pretty sick you got them to come, if they are here. Well, maybe I wrote what I read wasn't true, but... Is this the anthem for South Africa? I'm not even... I'm not sure. I feel like it sounds similar, but it might, it might not be. Yeah, there they are. See you, Khaleesi and Ed Smith. It's so weird seeing them in normal clothes. <laughs> Dude, Ed Smith is a freak. He's so big. <laughs> I guess they they're, didn't they play to, to today? Or yesterday? They must have played yesterday, yeah. So that workout versus Australia played yesterday, yeah. That that makes sense. Okay, so the timing worked out perfect. I honestly have no idea what's going to happen here. I feel like Izzy probably should win. I feel like his style is good against a guy like EDP. Where he can just, like, pick guys off as they attack him. But I felt it kind of the same way about uh, Izzy versus Strickland, so we'll see. I do think I read about a bunch that Adesanya was, has been, like, changing his style up. So if that's the case, I'm curious to see what happens, because obviously what he's done worked for a long time, but we'll see. The main event! Yeah, that sign here looks a little... Does he look nervous? He kind of looks nervous, but I guess he's just standing down. It's time! DDP laughing, that's not good. If you want to touch, do it now. God bless. <laughs> Yeah, what's gonna happen, man? I'm really curious to see if he changes his style up. Because he's been the same for like a long time, and I think he was talking about changing it up. But... Okay, he looks a lot more serious now. Yeah, is he so good at like. He's a counterfighter, right? He's like really good at countering, so DDP kind of bum rushes. But if DDP can like bum rush him and like. Izzy misses, then he like has an issue on his hands, right? Most of the time I've seen Izzy fight, he's been getting leg kicked by his opponent. Yeah, there's the blitz. Okay, there's the blitz. Oh, jeez, yeah. It's it, he. He literally looks like a chicken with his head cut off when he when he runs at people, but it like works. He doesn't look really at human when he runs at people. <laughs> the way he moves is so weird. Jesus, man. Ooh, man, that almost got him in the head. Oh, yeah, cut him the floor. Okay, that must have been from the kick then, right? I'm gonna caught him a little bit. Ooh, jeez. Uh oh. Okay. Good D, good D. Ooh, jeez, that was close. Ooh, watch out, watch out. Yeah, see, yeah, he, he bum rushes. You're not, I mean, it's not a 
not always a bum rush, but he like as soon as he thinks he hits you, he just rushes you like crazy. It's almost hard to counter. Ooh, that was that was close. Uh oh, that was good. Ooh, where's a good body? Yeah, he's, he's defending it good. Good round, good round. We saw that both guys were were kind of about. My heart rate's gone up by 20 since the fight started. <laughs> Translator's not speaking English for us. He's not. No. I could, there's no way that's English. I thought he was speaking English, but no, it's Afrikaans or whatever it's pronounced. Yeah, but the why native is tongue in South Africa. Well, and we need to hear know what they're saying. Though. <laughs> the com the com <laughs> the translator is not speaking English. <laughs> that was hilarious. The guy forgot his job. All right, here we go, round two. Ooh. Ooh, jeez, man. Ooh. I feel like DDP might catch him because he just, he, did, he legit just goes insane and just like starts to throw him. But it's, I mean, it's, yeah, it's hard to ignore. Izzy's like counters are crazy. Oh, there's a takedown. Nice, just nice. Get out, get out. I feel like I haven't seen Izzy wrestle much at all. Maybe like against Jan. Uh oh. Uh oh. No way. That's not good. Okay, that's not good. That's not good. Uh oh. That's a head. Oh no, he slipped out. Okay, that was a really bad crank. Oh no, he got it. No, no. Oh, he slipped out. Okay, there you go, Izzy. Nice job. Get up, get up, get away. There you go. That that wasn't a groin. Yeah, that wasn't a groin. That was right in the stomach. Izzy's being a bit more active. I feel like as soon as he got up from that, he was like pushing the pace on him. Ooh. Oh. I think that was a slip. That was just a slip. Fuck. Yeah, that was just a slip. I don't think he caught him there badly. They're both like dead tired, I feel like already. Alright, 15 seconds left, not really much that's gonna happen, I don't think. Yeah, Izzy gotta stay on the feet, obviously. If Izzy can, yeah, if Izzy can stay on his feet, he's... He's gonna win this, but... I don't know, DDP has some, like, his some of the punches he throws are just absolutely wild. I, I feel like he could KO him too, but... I don't know. Okay, round three. One, one, I think. Could you get that round to Izzy too, maybe? Maybe two, I'm not sure. He had the takedowns, right? So the takedowns are probably scored higher. He just goes like this and just like runs at you kind of. I feel like he can sneak a punch through there when he does that. Oh, that's a good body. <laughs> yeah, that's that's him talking. When he does that, I've noticed every time I watch GDT, when he puts his head down and just like runs at you, it looks so funny. But it's worked. Like it's worked in his career. Jeez. Legit, it's so funny. Yeah, he's, is he going to the body more? It's good. Yeah, double double the head and like five times the body. Ooh, jeez. I thought Izzy would got caught there, but he just spun perfectly. Oh, watch out, watch out. Did that elbow connect? I think I might have. Ooh, ooh, let's watch out, watch out. I think Izzy's hurt. Yeah, I think he's hurt. I think Izzy got hurt off that. He's, he should be. Oh, no. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. Izzy's, yeah, he's wobbling right now. He's not doing good right now. This is, okay. Izzy's definitely being more aggressive, though. Um, he does not usually walk guys down this much, I feel like. That must have been kind of the style change he was talking about. Uh oh. No. That was a slip. That was a slip, yeah. They both, like, gassed like crazy, too, which is for round three. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. They're both just like stepping into each other. This is crazy. This legit seems like it's round five, just with how slow they're moving right now. Oh man, it's so weird. Holy, 36, 15 in round three for strikes. That's crazy. It is not. I mean, I guess it. I guess it does. Yeah. Nice. I guess by the numbers, that's two one Izzy, but that did, that seemed a lot. Like to me, at least, it seemed pretty close that round. I feel like Izzy got hurt bad there. Not hurt bad, but like he got hurt. Yeah, they they both seem really tired. I think I've said that 50 times already, but for round three, it seems like they're both gassed out already, which is why. Yeah, don't get too greedy, the coach is saying. Yeah. Yeah, he's definitely being a bit more aggressive. That's opening up a lot more to take damage. So if he just can, brings it back a tiny bit, still aggressive, but bring it back a tiny bit. That's probably what they're trying to get him to do. Here we go. Round four. Two should be two one, is he? Yeah. 2-1, maybe 3-0, if it was, if it was, probably 2-1 though. I'm gonna go 2-1. Come on, crowd. It's, it was, it's dead right now. Nice, nice, nice. Ah. Oh, he choked, he choked, he messed it up. Ooh, man, his... Jeez. Jeez, the body, 22... 22 of 23 to the body is crazy. That kind of makes sense watching how Drickus fights, but that's still nuts. 22-23? That's gotta be one of the highest percentages ever. 
in like a fight that's gone like over more than a few rounds. I feel like Izzy isn't scared of DDP's power at all at the moment. Like, ooh, good combo. Yeah, this this looks this looks like like Izzy when he's at his best right now. Like the commentators were saying, he looks like he's just he's seeing everything connecting. Ooh, that was a good punch. Okay, that was a good one. And here's the here's the rush by DDP. I'm gonna slow him down a bit. He's got to be careful. Yeah, like, DDP landing. Yeah, he, Izzy's kind. I don't know. I'm not like smart enough. Ooh. Uh oh. No way. He's just told us. Oh my God, Izzy, what are you doing, dude? That was brutal. Uh oh. Oh my God, Izzy. Jesus Christ, Izzy. What the fuck was that? What the fuck just happened? Dude. I'm so confused what just happened. That came out of nowhere. That was so weird. Man, all right. Well, DDP, I guess fighting like DDP fights so weird that it just works. It's crazy. Is Izzy going to, I feel like Izzy might like retire. Yeah, I definitely just apologize. That's crazy though. What the hell happened? I need to see that again. He like barely heard him and just like, he just lost like his, like, right there. Yeah, that was, that was a huge punch. And he just was kind of out of it here. He was running away and just right there, that, that one, that one. Yeah, and then he just fell over and quickly, yeah, good takedown. Yeah, Izzy, Izzy didn't have the, the, the brain power there to, yeah, no, he had him right there. That's crazy. I think it could have legit been like three to one there at that point in the fight too. Well, I don't know what Izzy's gonna do. I feel like Izzy's been figured out at this point. Like, there's, yeah. Is he, like, is he gonna want to, like, like he's not getting a title fight for a while now. So he's gonna have to. They're doing Strickland DDP again next, right? I think. So maybe they'll do Izzy versus um, other Sia Khaleesi and Smith. Yeah. <laughs> He made a mistake, is what he's saying? Okay. Yeah, I don't know. He's getting, like, up there. I mean, he's not super old, but he's getting old, like... I don't know. I guess we'll see him fight a couple times, and then he'll go back for a title fight and maybe call it then. Dricka Stupacy. That's crazy. Crazy. I, I didn't see the odds, but what were the odds on him winning? I feel they must have been pretty heavily favored towards Izzy, right? I don't know. <laughs> Congrats, South Africa. That's... I mean, that's pretty awesome. I don't know... How I actually don't know how popular he is inside that workout, but I'd assume he's like pretty popular, right? In terms of UFC fighters, but yeah. No, congrats, congrats, South Africa, because yeah, that's awesome for you guys. Especially now that a lot, like, a, like almost like half my my viewers on on YouTube are uh, South African rugby fans, so it's pretty awesome to, to see that for you guys. <laughs> Let me know what he said, you guys. If any of you guys are watching from South Africa. Maybe, maybe they do so. Assuming Strickland loses the DDP, they do Izzy Strickland in like the spring. And then maybe one more fight for the winner of Izzy Strickland before like, getting another title shot. I don't know. We'll see. Izzy's just waiting there because he wants to talk. <laughs> the DDP won't shut up. <laughs> He's like, unfortunately, my uh, my stream just went out before the... Uh, before out of sound he got to speak so i'm not sure what he what he said or what he's gonna say but um i'm sure it'll just be yeah giving props to ddp it would be pretty funny to see them become friends because i feel like like long term it would be cool to see them like i mean i know the whole controversy with like izzy like like the whole not a real african thing people have been saying or that ddp has been saying at least and it would be cool to see izzy like I don't, I mean, I don't really know about this, but I, like, I'd assume maybe there's nothing with him, like, investing in, like, MMA and stuff in South Africa or in, in Nigeria. Um, so that would be cool to see if, if he, like, took some of the words that, like, DDP was saying and maybe start, or joining DDP maybe, and, like, investing in, like, grassroots MMA, like, maybe, maybe having a gym together or something. That'd be cool to see down the line. Uh, once, once his career's over, maybe, or something like that, cause that, that'd be, that'd be a pretty good way to spin the whole, um, rivalry i guess like just using it for good using their influence for good um but yeah no good fight though i'm I'm still pretty shocked about what happened i'm i mean i'm not yeah i'm not too shocked like izzy was getting he was getting hit and dd yeah like ddp even like it's crazy how he fights it's like 
<laughs> it should not work, but it does. It's so weird. Like, I've never, like, been trained in fighting. I don't know a ton about fighting, but just the way he fights is so bizarre to me. It, it legit, like, I think I said that it, like, doesn't look human at times. Or he just, he just goes like this and just, like, runs at you and just, like, throws. Like, there's a bunch of times he'll run, he'll, like, run past the guy when he moves out of the way. And just, like, he'll still be throwing when the time, by the time he, like, yeah, it's crazy. But it works. I don't know. It works. It's just such, it, it's kind of, it's actually kind of, I mean, it's not similar, like, like stylistically, like from how it looks, but like similar, like Yuri Pro Prostraka. Pro Prostraka? I'm so bad with names. It's similar to Yuri, and like they they just look really strange when they fight, but it works. Um, I mean, in, Yuri, in Yuri's case, it doesn't work for Alex Pereira, but um, it works, like, against most people, where you're just like, kind of like, ooh, all weird and, yeah, f sh hit f like throwing from weird angles. But yeah, so that there we go. Um, yeah, DDP wins. Very curious to see what Izzy's gonna do uh, going forward. He definitely said he's coming back. He said he's um, he made a mistake in the fight there, which I'm assuming is he started. Yeah, I'm assuming that, that was what his coaches were talking about. He started not. Um, he was he was being like, too aggressive. Like people always like would talk smack about him not being aggressive enough and being like boring. Which I mean, it's hard not to be when that's like your style. But um, he's he's been um. He definitely was trying to. I think he got overconfident, like trying to shut shut that up, the the boring fighter stuff. And he just started like he was he was winning that fight easily, and he just kept being the aggressor there, um, which probably cost him. But um, yeah, so it, it'll be like they're not going to give him a title shot anytime soon. He's going to have to like win twice before he gets a title shot. I, I, I'd assume, right? Like he got his title. He's, he got him. He got like immediate title shots twice now, I believe, after losing. Right? Yeah. Did he? Yeah, when he lost to Pereira, then he won it back. So that's one immediate title shot. And then he lost to Strickland, and then his next fight, he got it back. He got another um, not another title fight. Yeah, so he'll, he'll, have to, he'll have to fight. They'll probably make him do, do a Strickland fight, assuming Strickland doesn't win the title. He'll, he'll either be fighting Strickland or DDP next, I'd wager. Or maybe one guy before that to give someone else a chance, and then he'll get a fight again, get another uh, a chance. But yeah. Anyways, we'll wrap it up there. Thanks for watching. Um... Yeah, if you're still if you're still watching this point, uh, make sure to sub, uh, drop a like, drop a drop a comment or whatever. Um, I am I've been saying this for a while, but yeah, I usually I usually react to like if if it's like a banger card, I'll react to most of the fights, or if, if it's like a really good main event, I'll react to the fight. Um, but I, I have been like meaning for a long time to like start actually reacting to like MMA documentaries, M MMA like player or MMA fighter like highlights and stuff like that and like top tens and all that stuff i just never got around to it because my channel is mainly focused on rugby but i definitely want to branch out a bit more so um yeah if you're into that type of thing make sure to sub like the video comment your thoughts and yeah we'll wrap it up there thanks for watching